right, good morning everybody. So this week we will start how we typically do, have the countdown, should go right into the pad. Um, Candice will welcome us and we'll jump right into Holy Ground. So verse one will just be Candice and then chorus one will jump in there with her, staying in through verse two in the second chorus. Um, and then that first bridge will be out and then it goes back into it and that's where we'll come in and then we'll be in until the end of the song there. Um, from there we'll crossfade. Um, and, and what I want us to do this week, I'm just going to have us have an, like a prayer time together um, instead of just like a straight scripture reading, having us pause in our service here for a second and just have a communal time of prayer that's carved out for that moment. And then, um, yeah, and so Miranda, if you don't mind, if you want to play the King of Kings, you know, intro really soft behind, maybe a little bit slower, that's completely fine. And then eventually we'll get into King of Kings um, and Trina will lead us in this. So verse one will be Trina. We'll come in on that first chorus there together, staying in through verse 2. In the second chorus, verse 3, um, we'll go out, because that's almost like a bridge, verse 3, in the morning that you rose. That'll just be Trina. We'll come back in on verse 4, in the church of Christ was born, and then we'll stay in until the end of the song. And then we're going to have like a true crossfade into God of Revival, since these songs are in the same, same key. That'll work well. Um, so I'll take verse 1. And we're going to shorten this song a little bit too, by the way, just so everyone knows. Verse 1, I'll take a pre-chorus, and then we'll come in on the chorus together, staying in through verse 2, pre-chorus, chorus, all of that. And then bridge 1A, the first time through, I'll just take that, and then we'll jump in together. And then we're going to shorten it, so at like 4 minutes, 32 seconds, it goes into that longer instrumental before everything. I just feel like that that's a, a long time for us to kind of just sit there because uh, we're already going to be four minutes and 30 seconds into the song, which is pretty long already. And so um, during that time, instead, we're going to crash out at 432 and I'm going to tag um, the, like a down bridge there. So at 432, there's the long instrumental. We're just going to crash out um, instead of doing that. And then um, I'll just sing like a down bridge there. Um, and feel free to sing on that if you'd like. Um, I have no preference as far as y'all being out or anything like that. So just know that. And then we'll go down and come up and go into communion. And then from there we have the new song, A Thousand Hallelujahs. Um, and so verse 1, that'll just be Callie. Um, actually, let's do this. Excuse me. We'll start on the chorus, just like a down chorus. Um, and Callie just leading that time. So I think it would be good. Callie to just say, hey, we're going to sing a new song this week, um, coming right off of communion. This is such a great song. It talks about praise to the Lord, to the Lamb, um, to the King of heaven. And so we sing a thousand hallelujahs to him and we magnify his name. And so let's sing this chorus together. Just something simple like that that kind of sums up the song and sets it up. And then um, if you want to, we can just do with a thousand hallelujahs we might your name without a click or anything like that just something really chill and then we'll jump right into the song so on that first chorus when she's singing that down let's just sing um, melody together so that way no one gets confused on what the actual melody is and then from there we'll jump into the song so verse one will be Callie chorus one will be all of us in verse two uh, chorus and then does the interlude uh, that first bridge can just be Callie and then bridge two will come in. It does, you know, the chorus, interlude, uh, bridge three we can be in. And then that last chorus, um, you know, we can be in, just watch dynamics on everything. Um, so, yeah, so that is uh, the new song. I'm excited for it. I think it'll go over really well, um, especially coming out of communion into that. I think it'll be great. Um, so that is it. All right, band, this is where you will start the video here. Um, the biggest thing to note, um, we're going to have the usual countdown of everything with Holy Ground. Um, just know the key. Instead of E-flat, it's going to be in D, so that's the biggest difference there. Um, but as far as how we're playing the song, it's like the track. Just know that the key is different. Um, and then from there, we're not going to have like our usual scripture reading time. We're going to have a carved out like communal prayer time together. Um, and so Miranda, if you wouldn't mind, kind of obviously once D fades out, getting us into C. And you could play the King of Kings intro, maybe just a little bit slower, a little bit more chill. Um, and know that this song is in C, so both King of Kings and God of Revival are both in C. Um, that would just make a, a better transition, a better flow for those. But um, King of Kings, we're going to play like the track. Just know that it's in C instead of D. Um, but having that, we don't we don't have enough of that time where we it's like 
designated prayer time together. And so I want to make sure we do a better job of that. Um, and so that's what we're going to do during that time. And then we'll jump into King of Kings. From there, we're going to have a crossfade. It's going to crossfade right into God of Revival. Uh, again, note that this is in C. It's not in uh, D flat or anything like that. And so um, the thing with this song, we, we have always shortened it, but I want us to shorten it a little bit more. Um, I want to give enough time for the prayer time for communion and a thousand hallelujahs because we're also going to introduce that song. Um, and I'm going to talk through that in a second. Uh, but God of Revival at four minutes and like 30 seconds, four minutes, 32 seconds. That's where it usually goes into that big instrumental. Come awaken your people. And then it goes into that big bridge, you know. Um, and so instead, out of that chorus, instead of going into that big instrumental. Instead of doing that, we're just going to crash out there. And then I'll do a down bridge. Um, and I'll do bridge 1B. So just know that instead of out of that chorus. You already won, oh God of revival, oh God of revival. And it gets big, and it's that huge instrumental. We're just going to crash out there at 432, and I'll do a down bridge, uh, probably two, of um, bridge 1B. Come awaken your people, come awaken this nation, God of revival, pour it out, pour it out. And so it's something like that. And then we'll go down. Um, and then from there, we'll get ready to come back up after the message, and we'll go into communion. And then from there, I'm going to have Callie introduce a thousand hallelujahs. I think it would be good to open, like, as a really chill down chorus. With a thousand hallelujahs, we magnify your name. I just think that would be nice. Um, I'm going to have Callie say something very short, very brief before that. And then we'll jump into the song, and then the song's going to be like the track. Um, so we're going to play the full five minutes and seven seconds or whatever it is of the track um, and go through it like it is there. But that's the biggest thing to note is just how we're getting into the song. So that is it, guys. Thank you so much.